Thompson and Charles Cleverse in a department store. An original Yankee story by Mr. Charles Stewart. <laughs> well, Mother told me when I left home to come down to New York that she wanted me to bring home a lot of Muslim character in one thing or another. Well, <laughs> I started out to find one of them department stores, and I was walking along down the sidewalk when some fella throwed a banana ceiling on the sidewalk, and now I don't think much of a man. But there was a banana peeling on the sidewalk, and I don't think much of a banana peeling that there was a man on the sidewalk either. <laughs> My foot hit the banana peeling, I went up in the air and come down to flunk it. Just as I was picking myself up, a little boy came running across the street and he said, Oh, Mr. Countryman, won't you please do that again? My mother didn't see you do it. <laughs> But I found one of them stores. I bought a lot of muslin, calicure, and box hats, and grease, and razor, stop it, new pair of suspenders, and a jackknife, and one thing or another. And when I come to pay the fellow what I had to pay, he acted kind of suspicious to me. Didn't look like I was going to get any of my money back. I hand him a $10 bill, and he put it in a little basket and fixed it onto a wire. <laughs> The darn thing the men are running all over the store. Well, now you bet your boots. I lit out right after it. I chased it up one side and down the other. I knocked down five or six pairs of ladies and three or four bargain counters. And somebody commenced a hollering face. I said, yep, that's what I meant. <laughs> but I caught up to it when I did. I was back where it started from. 